This last day is um, Nixon Johnson. It was the hottest day of the year by far. It was July 17, 2001, and it was 102 degrees. Our air conditioner was busted, and the baby inside my swollen belly was telling me, it is time. The mechanic stated that he couldn't fix the condenser. My husband's employer stated that they couldn't get him back to the warehouse in time to get him to the hospital. I found a ride to the hospital only to hear the nurse state that she couldn't get me in a room. As the hours go by, I'm told I can't get an epidural right now. Once I get an epidural, the power goes out and I'm told the anesthesiologist can't make it back to my room to redo the epidural. I can't push yet. I can't push hard enough. I can't have my baby the normal way. I can't wait any longer. Can't, couldn't, wouldn't, not yet, no. Finally on July 18, I hear the cry of my eight pound, 12 ounce, 21 inch newborn baby girl, Macy Leanne Johnson. Again, I hear, you can't hold your baby, Mrs. Johnson. She's having trouble breathing, has a heart murmur, and she has some arm deformities. The doctors say it's whole arm syndrome, and she'll need several orthopedic reconstructive surgeries and heart surgery. They told us that they didn't know how this happened, and that life wouldn't be easy for Macy. The negative words and statements of doubt continued. Whispers from family and friends. Poor Macy. She won't be able to. She can't. How will she? The months progress into more rejection and doubt. Insurance and doctors say we can't. Therapist says, she won't be able. Family and friends say, you shouldn't. All the while, Macy is rolling, sitting up, holding her bottle, holding toys, pushing up to crawl, pulling up to walk, Holding her spoon, picking up Cheerios, and then I hear it. It wasn't no, can't, won't, couldn't, or don't. It was a small little voice, and she said, Me do it. I do it, Mommy. I do it, Daddy. And she, Macy Leanne, has not stopped saying, I can do it. Macy can write, type, play piano, draw, paint, sew, knit, crochet, make jewelry, Sing, bake, sometimes snap, <laughs> laugh, love, and live. Yep. Macy strives for the very best in everything that she does. She's beautiful inside and out. And they can and will do great things. We love you more than you will ever know. And remember to always keep on shining.
ingrained in this person that despite so many challenges, refuses to let it control her life. I applaud her resilience and character, and as the plaque reads, this person is an example of the triumph of the human spirit. And so on behalf of my family, on the Keep On Shining Committee, and of course Maddie, I am very proud to present this year's Keep On Shining Award to Macy Johnson. <laughs>